Have you heard of this fascinating theory called endosymbiosis or symbiogenesis? It's a theory that describes the origin of all eukaryotes, that is people like you and me, the plants and the animals around you. Now the idea was given way back in 1905, but then it developed into a theory when it was substantiated with evidence in 1967 by Lynn Margulis. According to this theory, more than two and a half billion years ago, the eukaryotes came into existence when one cell engulfed the other cell. And over time, these two cells evolved in such a way that they had now merged into one organism and were no longer recognizable as separate entities. Now, the main evidence for this is the organelles mitochondria and chloroplast. Both of these organelles are covered by two membranes, and the inner membrane of these organelles is very similar to that of the bacterial membrane. Not only that, they both carry their own DNA and can divide independently of the cell. That is, they can never be synthesized de novo or from scratch, and they have to be produced from a previously existing mitochondria or chloroplast only.